wouldn't it be cool if, if you're into affiliate marketing to go to Amazon or Home Depot or Best Buy and then collect up to a thousand URLs, put those URLs into some AI writing software, press a couple buttons, and then get up to a thousand product reviews uploaded automatically to your WordPress site with your call to action, with your affiliate link, with a relevant YouTube video about the product and with the images formatted properly. That'd be pretty cool. Let me demonstrate how to do that with ZimWriter. It's super easy. Now to do this, we'll need ZimWriter. We'll also need a Scrape Owl API key and we'll also need OpenAI. Both are very easy to get, very inexpensive. So we're gonna open up Penny Arcade. I'll move it right over here. And then I have a couple different cordless drills in here. Just for sake of time, we're just gonna do one. I'll take the URL and I'll just paste it in here. You don't need to mess with any anything special in here because I already have my WordPress site set up in here. I already have my Amazon affiliate code set up in here. It's all done for you once you configure those options the first time. So we have our URL. Now what I wanna do is I'm gonna disable this option and use a custom outline. Usually when I'm writing a product review, I don't want the AI just to come up with the outline. I'd rather have it follow a template for a product review or for a recipe or something. There's very like standardized templates you can have it follow. So I built a custom outline and here it is. You can copy it if you want, although you can create these yourself. ZimWriter gives you that flexibility. So it's gonna create an H2 that says overview, but then it's gonna optimize that for the title itself. It's gonna throw in a YouTube video that it finds. So it's gonna to go to YouTube, find that YouTube video. It's going to uh, get some detailed features and then add a call to action below that little button with our link to the product with our affiliate tag. It's gonna do some pros and cons and some concluding thoughts with another call to action there. So we're gonna use that outline and then we're gonna link up our WordPress site. Now I only have one site in here. This is a throwaway site that I made for AI testing, but you can put in up to 10 different WordPress websites and you can select how you want it to be published as a draft, I chose that. And then we don't have to click this button to add YouTube videos. You would normally need to if you're not using a custom outline, but our custom outline is using the YouTube trigger, the YouTube variable in here. So we don't need to click that button, okay? And then we just configure our options. So all this is gonna be overridden now because we're using that custom outline. I'll choose a second person voice. Actually, let's do a first person plural voice, a we, us, our. I'm gonna do literary devices, lists, tables, key takeaways. I'm gonna do short answer FAQs. I'm gonna do outlaw personality because people that use drills, builders and stuff like that, they're all like ah, rough and tough. So we'll do outlaw. I'm stereotyping here, okay, forgive me. And we're gonna do auto style. We're gonna keep this cheap and use GPT 3.5 turbo. We don't need the image API because we're using Amazon and we're gonna pull the image from Amazon. We will disable the conclusion and that's all we need. So I'll click start Penny Arcade. And we'll just, I'll speed the video up and we'll watch it work. Now, here's the site, it's gonna upload it too. It's gonna to be all automatic. We don't really need to do anything. And uh, that's it. Now, I again, I could have queued up to a thousand different URLs if I really wanted to, but we're just doing one for, for sake of time. And I'll just uh, watch it work and we'll see the results. Okay, the article is done. Let's go to our WordPress site and refresh it. And there it is. All right, let's preview it. Okay, so here's the article. Now it downloads the image from, and they're usually manufacturer images. If you don't want that, because you've got to follow all the licensing and, and, and whatnot and copyright rules, if you don't want to do that, you can disable that and you can either embed the images if you're allowed to do that, or you can use the Amazon API, whatever you want, just follow all the rules. Here is the title. Here's our intro. Now this table of contents is a, just a WordPress plugin. It's called, I think, WP Lucky. It's a free WordPress plugin I have. I really like it. Here's our key takeaways. Now here is our first H2 and our video that the AI found. So this is actually about the product. Yeah, about the product itself. Sometimes you'll get the product, sometimes you'll get something related to it. But by embedding a YouTube video, this is a great way to boost that page on time and then hopefully increase your rankings because you're not, people aren't bouncing from your article to go find another article. They'll, they'll be like, oh, hey, I really want to learn about this drill. They'll watch the video and then learn, learn more about it. So there's our first uh, subsection. Here's our next subsection. Now here is our call to action. If you look down there, if you look at the bottom, you'll see my, my Amazon affiliate code. So we can just double click on this. It will open up the page and it has our affiliate code already added right there. Yeah, so it already adds our affiliate code to all these products, very simple to do. 
pros and cons, some concluding thoughts. And then we remember we use that custom outline. So we told it to add another call to action right under here. The custom outline, super powerful. You can add YouTube videos wherever you want, call to actions wherever you want, makes it very easy. And then we have our frequently asked questions, the short version, we didn't choose the long version. So that's it, our article is now done. And I encourage you to pause the video and actually read this because one of the cool things about ZimWriter is the quality of the output, uh, very cool. That's all there is to it. If you wanna check out ZimWriter, there's a link in the description down below. Definitely check it out, join the Facebook group. We have almost 11,000 people in the Facebook group, lots of people that can help you out. Other than that, hey, good luck with your content generation. If you're not using ZimWriter to speed it up, you're probably doing something wrong. I can't wait to talk to you again. Till next time, I'll see you later.